So hello, this is Noreen Crone Findlay from CroneFindlay.com and uh, my blog is TottyTalksCraft.com There's Totty right there just saying hello from the story door. Totty is a little doll that I made. I carved her head uh, to match exactly a real tomato that we picked from our garden years ago and she had a whole world of adventures and I really must get around to doing a book for her. Um, there's Queen Victoria, the lady with the alligator purse back from the days when I was doing puppetry and I did a film for the National Film Board of Canada. And here's my husband and uh, our little dog. He did one he said, don't take my picture. Okay, so here's um, this one, my tapestry looms here. And there's Jane Austen and the Empress Theodora. This is one of my favorite corners of the studio. It's a desk that I, I do a lot of writing at. And uh, there's a painting of our daughter. I painted that when she was a little, little, little girl. Here's the Keep Calm and Carry On banner that I've just released the pattern for, our grandson's coat hooks. And the, um, that's the um, banner that I wove to become a, my avatar, the avatars and stuff, and I need to get around to doing that. Now, what I wanted to share with you today is a doll. She's a wall doll, an art doll. Um, that combines a whole lot of different techniques. Now, her crown is this part of her crown I wove on a frame loom. So this part's all woven. Now, her face here is embroidery. And this part of her body is inkle weaving. And you can see um, that there, the structure of her body, I'm going to flip her over a little to see if you can see it a bit better. What I did for her body was I crocheted her body um, and I did it in an open mesh and then I wove miles and miles and miles of cord of inkle uh, bands on my inkle loom and then you can see the, the copper wire of the crochet. Then I wove the inkle bands into the um, crochet to crochet wire as the framework. And so that gives her her structure. Her hands are, whoops, I, her hands are wire, quite strong wire that I wrapped the wire for her hands and then I can put things in her hands to hold them. Uh, this is punch needle embroidery again too, like her face. And I also did a whole lot of tatting and wove the tatting in as well. So you can see there's, whoops, a strand of something there. So there's also tatting and, um, oh, this uh, spool knitted section, here, oh, that's not spool knitted, pardon me. This round cord section is also done on the inkle loom, on the shack inkle. Uh, and it was done by passing the shuttle always just in the one direction and then pulling it up tight and that gives you a round cord. So this doll com uh, contains tapestry weaving, uh, punch needle embroidery, inkle weaving, crochet, uh, wire work and wrapping, and tatting to create one single piece so there are a lot of different aspects and elements and mediums in the one doll and uh, she's part of a series of I, i'm calling them my woven women there's a whole bunch of uh, whole bunch of a whole series a bunch yeah well, you know a whole series that I'm doing of uh, tapestries of magical and mythical women and uh, she is one of them and she's fun because she does combine so many different different and unique elements so happy weaving happy tatting happy embroidering happy crocheting from me here in the studio, Noreen Crumb Finlay. 
happy everything.